We have entered a four bedroom house. My God. Woo! Look how big this is. My God. Look how big this is. This bathroom is like a room. You can sleep here. <laughs> Hello guys. Welcome back to another video coming live from Nairobi, Kenya. I'm here with my sis Stella. Hi guys, my name is Stella. I'm so happy to be in my sister's channel, Ginyada. Subscribe! Hey. <laughs> so I'm also here with Josh. Uh, we did a video together last time. You guys liked it, but we want to clarify something. A lot of people were confused when we said Somali home, it, uh, Indian home, and the Chinese. Could you give people explanation? Okay. Here, you can hold it. Okay, like uh, if I say Somali house, uh, this means that the, the houses which have been developed. Yes. By Somalis. Right. Yeah, yeah. So it's developed by Somalis. Yeah, yeah. And Indians house, you mean Indians develop it? The Indians develop it. You say Chinese? The Chinese, Chinese develop it. But the workers are Kenyans and well a lot of people are saying oh 90% of apartments or buildings are owned by Kenyans we're not disagreeing with that yeah, yeah. but we're just showing you that this country is diverse and a lot of people are owning and building yes correct so today is different we are in Keleleshwa it's also a very uh, we could say rich neighborhood. Uh, rich, very rich neighborhood. Yeah. So I want to show you guys some of the homes uh, in Kelaleshua. Are we tar we targeting Somali homes? We're targeting Somali homes. Uh huh. Arab homes and Chinese homes. Okay. So I hope you guys understand when we say Chinese, Somali, Indian. The developers are from the those backgrounds but uh, the workers are obviously Kenyan okay so stay tuned and uh, guys people love this I want to show you guys more we will do Lavington we will do other places and we will create a platform where you guys can reach out to the uh, agents and and you know if you want to seriously want to buy house or if you seriously want to rent uh, a way to contact I like the entrance so this how much how much is this uh, rent for this three bedroom this three bedroom is uh, six huh 160,000 160, Kenya yes. shilling for three bedroom. Yes. Plus so mm -hmm. I like to give my people how much it is in dollars. Oh, uh, what rate is it now? 140? Yeah, so 160,000 is about 1,100 US dollar per month. Yes. And to buy is how much? To buy, we're looking at uh, about uh, 25 million. 25 million for this three bedroom? Yes. Let's see, 25 million. Yes. Can you shilling? Woo! 170,000 US dollar. My God. So, there is a, another client looking around. We will go inside and show you. But for now, look, there is a, there is a pool here. And the seating down there is very beautiful. We will go down. It's very beautiful. They have gym. There's a kids playground over there. So I guess when you add few things that makes the apartment, you know, look good and it attracts the client. For example, if you're a family, mm -hmm. you have the kids playground, you yes. have you have the gym. We have also an indoor games room. Huh? Indoor game room. Yes. Wow. We have uh, the gym. We have a TV uh, TV room downstairs. Okay. We so we, we will go look at that? Yes, we are looking at uh, a full backup generator. In oh, case. in case things go south. Yes. 
You know, guys, sometimes the electricity goes away in Kenya. Uh, <laughs> but we are fully backed up. You are backed up. You are like a hotel. <laughs> yes. Mm. So it's outside when I was coming in, it says Arab style. Uh, Dubai style. Dubai style. Uh, so, okay, the concept was, it was borrowed from, uh, okay. You know, like a Middle Eastern style? Yes, you know, um, the developers are from uh, Turkey and Egypt. Okay, so. they're from Turkey and Egypt, the yes. developers. Yes. So they had this idea. It does look like a Middle Eastern, you know, you have the nice yeah, that was the idea. patio outside. Mm. Uh, wow, we will go down, guys. But yes. keep in mind 170,000 to buy and 1,100 dollars per month. Let's go check it out. <laughs> so, this is the master, the master bedroom. Wow, hey, it's beautiful. It has a Ooh. okay, look at this. God. So you have your little yes. bathtub. Yeah, yeah, bathtub. Wow. Beautiful. Uh, can we can we just finish? This is the second. Second bedroom. Okay, it's not as big as the other one, but it's bigger. It's, uh, it's big. So you enter from here, boom. You Every house comes with closet, guys. I think I told you guys. This is the bathroom. Very small. Obviously, it's not a master bedroom, so. <laughs> My favorite one. Hey. <laughs> so this is the third one. Yes. Wow, beautiful. So it has balcony. Yeah, it has a small balcony. Small balcony, this one. Okay, it's not bad. Good morning, my neighbor. <laughs> so this is the third bedroom, guys. Uh, okay. So the master bedroom is always bigger, you know, you're attracting the client, you're like, okay, here's a one big bedroom, but two medium rooms. <laughs> so guys, my favorite part, my favorite part is the living room. Woo! <laughs> guys, this is the massive living room. You can put your dining table here, and then your big TV there. Your couch could be like in the middle, right? And then you have a nice big balcony here. Eesh. Again, views. You can see down, and this is the pool. Guys, Kilalesho is a very beautiful area, to be honest. And it's quiet, you know? That's how you know it's a rich area. <laughs> quiet. <laughs> so, Let's go in and see how big it is, you see? Very big living room, my god. No wonder it's 170,000 US dollars. Would you buy this? Is it worth it to pay 170,000, which is 20 million, right? 25. 25 million Kenya shilling. Let's go down and see the gym and see the patios and uh, the pool area. So well, guys, there's a common toilet, you know? If you have a guest over, you don't need to send them to your bedroom. So you can just use this. And I just want to add a little bit the kitchen. So does it come with this? Yes, the oven, the oven, and the food. So it comes with all of this? Yes. OK. Hey, this looks like a modern chimney. <laughs> and uh, there's a DSQ. A lot of people don't know. DSQ this is like, laundry, yeah. yeah, so this is the laundry area. And then the DSQ is usually people, they allow the person, the housemaid, and, you know, to live there. Yes. So, this, they have, she has, or whoever is the housemaid is using the toilet here. And then a nice little bed here. And uh, she can exit through here or through here. Cool. All right, let me know what do you guys think. Uh, 
this apartment in Kelelesho, is it worth it? Let me know. We are down right now. This is the common seating. I uh, just want to show you. Imagine. And then here, there's more common seating. You see? No wonder it's expensive. They added a little extra twist here. You see? They have nice patios. So, hey, let me, let me see, let me see. How comfortable. Hey, this is good. This is good. This is good. Wow. Wow. I think this is the type of environment I like. Let's go see the gym. Oof. Pool. My God. Wow. Hey. Whee. <laughs> this is the pool area. Hey. Wow. I don't want to get up. Wow. Mm. Barbecue grilling. Wow. No wonder this place is fully occupied. <laughs> this place is literally fully occupied. This is the pool. Wow. Okay. There's a nice gym here. Wow. You can swim, you can work out, and you can chill outside. All right, guys, let's go to see another apartment. This is it. Let me know what you think of this apartment. 170,000 US dollar, which is 25 million Kenya shilling. Um, this is the this is a Somali house we are entering now. It's owned by Somalis. It's not open yet. December it will be ready, but it's already fully taken. People already have have paid. They're just waiting to move in. But I just want to show you how the Somali houses look like. Common toilets. This is a Somali house. Okay. This is the kitchen. I'm telling you guys, Somalis love big houses. Let me stand here so you can see how big this kitchen is. Very big. Okay. I think there is a. Hey! This is where you have the laundry. It has a DSQ room for the maid. This is the toilet. They don't have light. But uh, let's go see. Let me show you the living room. Again, the kitchen comes with this. Hi! My God. <coughs> Right. So from the living room to the bedrooms, you have this big hallway. So this is our, our first bedroom. Ooh okay. You have a closet. Ay ay ay. Very spacious. That's a park. There's no balcony, but okay. Let's go see. Wow, 
This must be the master bedroom. Whew. This is the bed. Okay. Closet. Whee! Now this is the bathroom I want. Look at this. My God. My God. You have balcony. Okay, nothing major, but you have nature, greenery for the eyes. So this is the master bedroom, you see, very spacious, very big. Let me close this. I just want to sleep here. Man, these showrooms are, are taking over. All right. Third bedroom here. This is also very big. Mm. Has a very spacious bathroom. The living room. So, how much is this for buy? 30 million. 30 million. 30 million. And only two, one, 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 uh, three bedroom. Uh, only left. Uh, one, three bedroom, left. one, four bedroom. Left. Yeah. Wow, 30 million. Yeah. That's yeah. like 30 million Kenyan yeah. shilling. That's 204,000 yeah. US dollars. And to rent for a month? Rent is one hundred sixty. Oh, okay. Mm. One hundred sixty thousand, which is like one thousand one hundred US dollar, at this rate today. So, this is this house is two hundred thousand US dollar. It's very big, very nice. Let me know, guys. Is it worth it? Would you buy it? Two hundred k. Oh, let's see. There is a balcony here. Oh. Hey, very spacious, very spacious. We have entered a four bedroom house. My God, Woo! look how big this is. My God, this is just the living room here. to even look at it it's, you can see from here it's very dusty we don't want to go in 
but uh, mm -hmm. so they're not the bedrooms. Come, let's see the bedroom. Mm -hmm. with the price. Once you hear the price, you will go, ah! Ah! So Josh, mm -hmm. how much is to rent and the four um, bedroom? And the four bedroom is going for 180. 180,000 Kenya shilling, Kenya shilling uh -huh. which is like uh, 1,000, uh, One, 200, 300 dollars. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. And then to buy the four buy, bedroom? To buy is around 32 million. Okay, 32, mm -hmm. which is like 200 and uh, 15,000, nothing. The other one was 30, this is two, you know, it's just extra 200, mm -hmm. two, million. two million, yeah, difference. Wow. But they can always be cheaper. Hey, that's it, mm -hmm. four bedroom. Four bedroom. So guys, please let me know what you think. Uh, this is a Somali home and it's fully taken, right? Yeah, fully taken. And only the three bedroom one we saw is. Yeah, there's only uh, one three bedroom and mm. one four bedroom left at the moment. And how many units they have? Mm -hmm. Do you know? Mm. Okay, mm. okay. Mm. So guys, there's only two left: one three bedroom and one four bedroom. Mm. Everything else is taking, and they opening this building December. 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 Mm. Ah. Mm. Guys, I'm loving the view here. Stella, what do you think? My God, I've never been to have such a place like this. It's amazing, huh? Mm. And that's for it. My God. Nice. So guys, that's it. Let me know what you think. Uh, is it worth it? Uh, to me, I think it's worth it, the price. Because at the end of the day, you are investing in your future. You're investing in your children, if you have children. These homes are for families, to be honest. No single person would live in a four bedroom. Common sense. So someone for family especially children this type of house is definitely worth it you we pay sometimes like four hundred thousand us dollar five hundred thousand almost million dollar houses in america in europe you know but this one two hundred thousand four bedroom with a you know dsq with nice balconies i'm sure once they finish it will look even better so that's it from kalalashua let me know what you think in the comment section. This house especially, the Somali design, I love it. It's very big, very spacious. 
Uh, I wish they had. The one we came from is winning because it has a nice patio and, you know, nice chilling spot, nice gym. Do you think they have gym here? Yeah, the gym will be around, there will be swimming pool. Oh, so they will have gym and the swimming pool in this yeah, one. Yeah, yeah. Okay, good. So, but that one, it was like a, you're in a mall, you know what I mean? You get the food, you have the chilling spot, you have everything in open space. Um, that's it from Kalaleshua, guys. Again, if you're interested, please contact me directly through Instagram and I will share the information. If you know, only serious inquiries because the agent cannot just answer common questions you know if you are interested seriously and you want to buy or you want to you know rent contact me and i will direct you to my agent he helped me with my own property as well so that's it for today please don't forget to share the video don't forget to like the video i always appreciate all the love and support that i get from you guys and don't forget check out check out the link to the airbnb if you're interested also check out my paypal if you want to donate to the to my travels uh that's it till next time bye bye